welcome to 1742R Frankfurt Avenue. My name is Norman Dixon and myself and my husband Patrick Owen are the owners of this carriage house property newly built in our backyard. This is our house right here. And this would be your house. And right along the side of the house here is a path, a sidewalk that goes down to Frankfurt Avenue and all of the restaurants and bars and fun things that Frankfurt Avenue has to offer. Behind me is the alley where the garage opens and there's a one car parking for the tenant of 1732R in the garage. So it's secure parking with a private entrance through the garage in addition to this entrance from the outside, which is great for walking pets or for inviting guests to come and see you. So I'm gonna take you on a tour and show you the apartment and all of the features that it has to offer. So this is the private entrance, which leads to a landing. Follow me. Um, this is the entrance to the garage, which I'm just gonna open the door really quickly and show you. You have your own stall in the garage with an automatic opener, which you share with us. You have storage in the garage. This is all reserved for you. So you have lots of room to place your things. You can store a bike here. And now we're gonna go into the apartment. One thing I want to point out is there's a place to hang your coats and bags when you first come in. Leave your boots here if you wish. So here we are in the great room. This apartment has 900 square feet. And this is the living area. There's a place to install a television. There's a ceiling fan. There's AC and heat. Um, one of the features I want to point out is the double height entry hall with this large chandelier. So now I'm going to draw your attention to the kitchen. This is a really great kitchen with lots of storage. Um, granite countertops with seating for four along the bar. All of the cabinets have soft closed doors and soft closed drawers. And the pantry, which you can see here on both sides of the fridge, have slide out drawers also soft clothes. There's a spot here for trash and recycling. You have a dishwasher. Gas stove. Farmhouse sink. This vent above the stove is vented outside, so when you're cooking, any smells or things like that get vented to the outside. This is an authentic vintage Hoosier cabinet, um, which comes with the apartment if you want. If not, we can remove it. But we think this would make a really cool bar. You can put your bottles of liquor here. You can store glassware up here. A little display here. More storage here, storage underneath, and drawers as well. So now we're going to move into, oh, Patrick wants me to show you the cabinet at the end of, end of the island. So there's even more storage here. There's lots of storage in this kitchen. The blinds on the windows are Roman shades that don't have any strings. So you just pull them down for complete privacy, and then when you 
don't want them down, you just grab a little plastic thing and slide them up. And they're completely invisible. So now moving into the large bedroom, also with the ceiling fan. Um, same thing here, this blind, Roman shade, it's a dark shade, so this one has a little bit more light blocking properties. This bedroom is large enough for a king size bed with nightstands or bedside tables on either one. You can put a seating area in the corner, you can put a dresser, you can put a desk for a work at home office. Um, also, there is storage in the attic. I won't open the whole thing, but you can see there's storage up there. There's a light, there's a light up there that also lights so you can see what's up there. There's a walk-in closet with lots of storage, shelves, we've got drawers, self-closed drawers, um, lots of shelves, books, lots of hanging over here, hanging here, hanging here, a uh, pocket door, if you want to close it or just leave it open all the time, in-unit laundry, full-size washer, dryer, brand new, never been used. There's a little rack for storing your laundry stuff, your detergent and your dryer sheets and whatnot. There's an entrance to the bathroom from the bedroom. The bathroom features this mirror which is lit from behind. You can change the color on the mirror so you can have that light a bright white or a warm light. And this little button here with the little wavy things, when you turn that on, that heats the mirror so that when you have a shower, you don't step out to a fogged mirror. That keeps the mirror clear. Um, there's a vintage medicine cabinet. Turn, turn the lights back oh, on. Oh, sorry. Turn the lights back on. Um, there's also a transom window cut in up here so that light floods through from the window on the other side so that it allows natural light into the bathroom as well. There's a lovely fully tiled shower um, in the bathtub, the little storage shelf for your beauty products, shampoo, marble topped vanity, marble topped vanity, whoops, vanity with some closed drawers, storage underneath, there's also an entrance from the bathroom into the great room, so when you have guests, they don't have to walk through your bedroom to get to the bathroom. So, Patrick's going to come out here, and I'm going to show you that there's a little coat closet, so you can hang your coats, or your guests can hang their coats. Added storage, there's a shelf up there. The water heater closet here with a rack that you can hang brooms and different things like that.